recovering from the biggest heartbreak of my entire life. And it took me years to realize that it wasn't my ex that broke my heart. It was me. I stayed for so long with someone who clearly did not choose me back. Why didn't I leave? Why didn't I stand up for myself? It's been so hard forgiving myself for these things. But this heartbreak has returned me home to me. I know who I am now. I know what I want. And I'm so grateful. And we take the negative log of the H plus concentration, one times 10 to the minus seven. When we add those two together, we eventually get 40. It is a bit later and it's supper time. So I got this from Spa. I love potato bake. It was only like 30 rand. So if you want to try it, this is how it looks. Okay, so it's four small portions of potato bake. I honestly, I did not read properly, I guess. But I guess this is going to be my supper. Okay guys, so this is how it came out. It is so little. It's a very small serving. It's literally a hundred grams. Like it is small. <laughs> so I put it in a small bowl. And then I had some salad things, so I just threw together a little Greek salad, my favorite. I'm not a lettuce person. And I put it in a small bowl as well. So this is my supper. I'm really not hungry, I guess, you know, getting in a good meal, comfort food, healthy, but a small portion. I mean, besides the fact that I'm trying to lose weight, I do not eat like this normally, the small portions. But, you know, this is, I guess, you know, Chinese people eat like this out of those small bowls and they look great. So I don't know, maybe this should be a thing for portion control. I don't know, but I'm going to eat this, drink my water, and I'm currently watching some Teen Wolf on my laptop. This is my little outfit for the day. I had to put my hair up in a little messy bang. <coughs> my gosh, did I just almost die and choke on my own spit? But yeah, that is it. This is a t-shirt. That I thrifted my nice tote bag from Cotton On, which I'm hoping to fill with some thrifted clothes. We're gonna see how it goes. I haven't been to a thrift market in Pretoria, so I'm really excited to see how it goes and what they have. I am just waiting for my mom and my sister to get here. So, yeah. It was so hot. Oh my gosh. It was a very hot day. And I only found, well, I only bought one thing. There were some really, ooh, there were some really good stores. But honestly, a lot of the things were quite pricey. So I was like, you know, being very picky. But here is one of the stores that I went to and I got oh these brown pants for only 50 rand. I really hope they fit me. I'm gonna try them on now. But I'm really excited. They are very nice. And I need some more pants, so yeah.
sitting here on my balcony looking like a scruff ball watching the planes in the sky like i honestly wish i could go to the air show i really do but it's quite expensive but i'm right to go monday so i really need to study so i'm just gonna uh, oh! Hi guys, so it is Tuesday, it is 7 o'clock, I just got home. I had no intention of vlogging today, I just got back from the gym. I went for a cycling class, this was my first time like doing it. Guys, it was so nice. But the whole reason of me taking out the camera is I really have a craving for ice cream. It is so hot in Pretoria it is crazy you guys so I was like let me go to Woolworths buy my favorite ice cream and then you know I did that little thing that I do in my brain where I'm like no Alison let's save money so that part of me won today and I decided I'm gonna make Ooh. Oh, nightmare. I'm gonna make my own ice cream I have some coconut cream in the cupboard, so we're gonna do that. I've never done this before, but I am obsessed with vegan coconut, mango, and mint ice cream. I do not have mango though, but we're gonna come up with something. I do not know how it's gonna go, how it's gonna taste. I'm doing it for the first time, and I wanted to do it with you guys. Okay, so I'm just like squishing it up a bit, especially like the blueberries. Close this up and put it in the freezer. Okay guys, it is the next day and this is the bottom of the container. How good does this look? So I did take a bite of it earlier on and I definitely should have put sugar in this to be honest because it just tastes like coconut cream, but not really like good. I think next time I try this, I definitely want to follow a recipe. So for now, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this, but I just thought I would give you guys an update on the vlog. But I mean, apart from it not tasting nice, it looks so good if it did work out. <laughs> 